Welcome, Leo and Crosswalkers. This is Mystic Intuition bringing you a general love reading. There are timestamps always in the description box of my videos if you ever want to skip straight ahead. Please remember that time is fluid, so that means this could represent a past, a present, or a future situation for you if it does not resonate. And even if it does, please to check out your moon, your rising, and your Venus signs for additional messages and guidance. I'm going to read your energy at the top and there's the bottom, but as this is general, it can be flipped or reversed. We have destiny under the deck or the wheel of fortune, passion and guided the ace of wands, and we have financial and material changes here. So there is a situation, okay, with someone that you've met, okay, you may have recently met this person, okay, or, you know, there's just like this very new, very exciting, like, butterflies in your stomach kind of thing but this person's like working towards something they may have some kind of financial struggles or difficulties um it's like needing to see each other needing to get together let's get clarification here with some tarot all right for leo sun moon rising and venus signs it could be an opportunity for this person Page of Wands, that is fire, energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So you, you like this person. They're exciting. They're fun. They could be a little bit younger than you, or you could be the younger person here, but there could be also children involved. I, and again, I know this, we're just starting out this reading, so just bear with me, guys. Some of you, uh, again, not all of you, don't jump on it, right? Some of you maybe have a child with this person, or maybe finding out that you were pregnant. Um, so just be careful if that's not something you're trying to do, okay? Because I feel like with this, it's like unexpected news, okay? Kind of uh, created out of passion, uh, like this intense connection with this person. It's very flirtatious. Yeah, you want to build stability with them. You like this person. You could work with them or you could... Um, just like how they're like responsible, resourceful, reliable, like what you're looking for in a partner, earth energy. Like you see them as like a good family person. Could be a Virgo, Gemini specifically that you're dealing with. Uh, but the magician is someone who's able to create things, okay? They're able to manifest. They're able to, you know, make it happen. Oh yeah, you like this person. You really do like them. Um, you fell for this person. You fell for them hard. This person's very um, good at what they do, okay? This person, it's like whatever they put their mind to, you like, they don't, they're able to make it happen. They see things through. You like it about this person. I feel like this is kind of really new or like it just feels very exciting. Like it still feels very new. Like it's like, it's like the energy of like, they never stop surprising you in a good way. That's what I want to say. Like you may have had your walls up before, but you've come to this realization here that, you know, this is what you've been looking for. And you see yourself with this person. You see yourself settling down with them, creating a life with them. You know, you feel deeply connected to them. You feel like, you know, it's built on a foundation of friendship, of trust. But there's this very intense connection with them. Now, in their energy, they could be having some like, job difficulties. I mean, could, some of them, it could be related to COVID and stuff like that. Um, some of them could be changing jobs or something. Oh, yeah, Ace of Wands twice. When they think about you, I mean, they're deeply attracted to you. This is, it's almost, it's almost, how do I want to say this in like um, the right way, Spirit? Because it's almost, it's almost um, like the way it, I'm seeing it and feeling it, it's like it's almost dangerous, the chemistry you guys have. It's almost like explosive. It's like a very intense, very primitive kind of energy. That's, that's how, you're, we're adults. We'll leave it at that, okay? Deeply attracted to each other, okay? Yeah, Leo energy here. There you are, right there in their heart space. You make them happy, okay? The sun is the happiest card in the deck, and that's how they feel about you. This is about clarity. This is about seeing things as they are. Um, absolutely beautiful energy. You know, this could be new life for some of you. They want it all with you. All right, but they may be struggling with some financial difficulties they haven't told you about. I feel like this person presents themselves very well. 
you know, I feel like um, they, they're very resourceful, they're very hardworking, responsible, and you like that about them, but they may be ashamed to tell you that there's some kind of financial change in their job, okay? Like they may have lost their job or they may be helping people with money, like friends, family, and, you know, getting taken advantage of in that way. Uh, they could be like losing their business or something for some of them, but it's like they don't want to tell you that. They don't want to tell you that, yeah, because it's it's hard for them to talk about they they take great pride in what they do okay in their ability to create things they don't want to it's and again it's not it's not that that even matters to you that those little things like money and stuff like that you know you can take care of yourself um but they want to impress you okay you have that quality about you it's like you're so beautiful and kind and adventurous and fun and they like everything about you and they want to look good for you they want to deserve you okay and that sounds cheesy but that's how i feel it and it's like it's 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 hard for them to talk about like they want to like you may feel like this person's pulling their energy back kind of unexpectedly okay from you in a way and it's because they're almost ashamed of some things that's kind of happened okay like they they can't seem to catch a break there's a lot of things collectively piling up for this person right now that they're not really talking about um could be something kind of honest it, it could be a loss okay it could be uh a state of depression for some of them um, could be unexpected move, change, travel. Like I said, they could have, you know, gotten into a situation that, you know, like giving someone money or something like that, lending it to them and got, you know, uh, taken advantage of. But this person, it's like they're concerned about that because they want to build a life with you. They don't know how to make that happen. They feel very confused. They want, they want to be your emperor, Aries energy. They want to come at you very strong and stable and grounded and be able to provide you with the things that you deserve, okay? But they're ashamed of their situation. Pisces, Cancerian energy, uh, also Scorpio. Some of them, if they if they already have children existing with someone, that could be a part of it, okay? Uh, it could be like child support or like uh, someone who's like asking for a lot of money from them or something like that, and it's like it's putting a, a financial strain on them. This person's kind of, they're kind of, you feel like they're holding back. It's like because they're contemplating about something. There's some way they want to move forward. Cancerian energy here. They, listen, they, this person, they want to make it happen with you. All right. They, I mean, they want to move forward. Okay. But they're having to wait. They're having to kind of get a handle on some things. They're working through some kind of issue behind the scenes. You are what they want, but they have to kind of figure out how to make, how to come towards you, okay? How to, you know, bridge that distance, bridge that gap, because it's like there is some kind of restriction here. Um, they see you in the future. Look at that. They see you there, okay? They see you there, Queen of, of Wands. They want to come together with you. They want to make an offer to you. They feel like you're part of their destiny, but they feel like they can't right now. They feel like almost ashamed of their situation. I got, okay, I gotta be real with some of y'all, okay? Uh, I want you to see what's all under here. Oh, my goodness. I'm gonna take them all. I'm gonna take them all because I just can't help myself. All right, so, uh, Wheel of Fortune, they feel like you're part of their destiny. It's just a matter of time. This person will come, you know, I don't feel like you guys are completely disconnected, but I feel like they, their energy has been a little bit different lately. You may be feeling some of that. Feel a little bit anxious about it. Um, there's something they haven't said to you. There's something that they're feeling kind of confused about right now. Uh, the Hierophant, Taurus energy. This person's trying to learn from something. They're trying to kind of overcome something. They could be help, like I say, they could be helping a lot of other people. They could be like giving to people, investing into something, you know, because they're loyal, they're kind, okay? They get taken advantage of in that way. They do feel this connection with you and they are coming in to be triumphant here. Now we have the Empress and the Emperor here. So very intense connection. You see what I'm talking about here? This even could be a twin flame connection for some of you. Aries, Taurus, Libra energy, all right? They feel like you are the divine feminine or the divine masculine to their better half. You know, you are the person that completes them. Obviously, this person, they want growth. They want creation with you, okay? They want to be the provider, the protector. And it's not that you need that, but they want to give you that, okay? They want. They don't want to come at you empty-handed. They're going to move towards you very quickly. They're thinking very fondly of you. With all of this wands and all of this energy here, I do feel, again, for some of you, you could end up finding out that you are pregnant. You may have children with them existingly. Um, so just be, for those of you who are, you know, just be careful if that's not what you're um, hoping for here. But 
this person, give them a little bit of time to kind of sort through some kind of financial mess or situation that they're currently dealing with because they will come back at you full force. Okay, it's, it's not it's not a matter of not lo having love or emotion or not being invested in this. Um, and again, this is general. Take what resonates, leave what does not. But this person's dealing with something. I think you intuitively kind of picking up on that. You feel that, okay? But this person, they don't they don't want to disappoint you. And it's not that you would even care about that. You can take care of yourself. Um, you see long term with this person, and they see that as well. Okay, they do want that with you. You're almost like infatuated with each other, but they just they they put you so high on this pedestal. They just they they think you are like everything and they just want to be able to impress you and provide for you and protect you and you know give you everything that you deserve they're working through some kind of mess they're a little bit ashamed of their situation okay so they will kind of come back around and kind of open back up about some of this stuff as they've kind of got a handle on it but it feels like they're kind of needing a little bit of time to kind of get something in order okay all right so this was your reading i hope that you guys enjoyed this please remember to like comment and subscribe Thank you all so much to those of you who have donated. I am wishing you all strength and many blessings. Bye-bye.